Oh, oh, oh man. Oh, my God. Well, it's Minnesota opener today. And uh, I'm gonna meet up with Shebs, but I figured I would start and take a little bit of a plunge here. There's a raccoon that had seen better days. I have never been on this stream. So I don't know if there's even any fish here. But there were there were plenty of cars here. today but it is no skunk on Minnesota opener here we got a little brown trout right at about nine eight put them down there we'll try this one yellow eyeball black tungsten another biter Minnesota is uh, five fish in total, only one over 16 allowed. I can tell you that's a great regulation. I wish we had that in Wisconsin. There's not, I'm not going to keep that one. Nice looking fish though. And I think that is the guy that bit two or three different times. He's going right back to where he was. So I think this is one that I would normally keep, but I'm not going to keep him. He's kind of skinny. I'm going to fish all the rest of the day with Shebs, but nice 14. Bridge here back. Yeah, there's a dead sucker. trout mixed in. Now this is a nice trout. I think if he isn't 16, I'll keep that one. Oop, come back here, yeah. Let's see what size this guy is. He goes 15, so I'm going to keep that trout. Definitely going to keep that trout. Get you a close up when I get him here. Pinned up. So that's 
that's a pretty decent trout for this time of year. Tie on my stringer, and I like to keep them as live as I can until um, ice time. So this guy goes 15, so he counts towards my smaller limit. But you can see, there's a pretty decent Minnesota brown trout, and uh, he goes 15. So that'll be dinner tonight. Awesome. And they will hang out in the same spots this time of year during the spawn. I got off. Shoot. I was gonna try to net him, but that fish was wrapped around my leg. Dang it. Dang it. Okay. Well, we'll get out at the legal out here and I'll see you with Shebs in a little while. Plan B. All right, Minnesota opener. Here we come. Maybe a hair too small for the stringer. No, in fact, that might be a stringer fish. Ooh, a couple of risers. He's bleeding. He's big enough to at least be worth the trouble. A couple of those and I'll be happy. Smoke some trout for the in-laws for Easter brunch. There's a much bigger fish in that pool still. Not monstrous, but 13-ish. Brown. Yep. Just a little baby brown. Little teeny guy. Oh, 
A jumping fool! Yeah, pretty guy. Super yellow. That's a big dog, damn. Hey, 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 hey. Simmer. Yeah, I don't know if I want one that big. <laughs> yeah, that's an 18. Do you want him or should I put him back? I don't want this much meat. I just want a couple little guys. No, super clean, front of the mouth. It's a nice looking fish though. 18, female, real pretty colors. Yeah, no, she was just three in the, in the tip of the snout, so she's totally good. I just want a couple like 12 or 13s. I don't want that much meat. It's just for me and Yeah, I ain't trying to feed the whole family. I'm just trying to have, have an appetizer. It's only four of us. That's more like it. That's a stringer fish. Oh, that's a brook. Get out of here. That's sure is. Bleeding. Maybe I'll have brookies for breakfast. Shit. That's a goner. Damn it. Well, give me the stringer. This one's a toaster. That sucks. Finally catch a bro. Hey. Crazy one. Brookie, not bad. That one's brown. Not quite worth the trouble. <laughs> Next year I'll eat you.
Not quite. There's another guy. There we go. Give me that stringer. What's that? That one's a perfect eater right there. Chunky, about 11 or 12. Oops, I got your. There. Yeah, right on 11. That's the perfect size for the smoker. Now I got the two fish that I want. Silver. That's a nine incher. It's another brook. Another brookie. That was a little cutie. Off you go. Just a little six or eight incher. It's a bunch of fish right here, dude. It's one really nice one, about 15 and chunky. You want him for the stringer? He might be goner anyway. That's a pretty one. Oh, yeah. Do you want one more? He's perfect size. I think that puts you at four. What do we got on here? We got four on here and two of them are mine. So that puts you at four. So you got one left on your limit. This guy's a little on the skinny side, but that's okay. Finally. Decent one too. This guy followed this lure three times. Oh, I got him on the outside of the gill plate. It's about a 14 or so. He came right up to your mud cloud basically. Got him. Ooh, that's a nice fish. That's not the same fish. This is a much bigger fish. <laughs> hey, damn, this might be 20. He is an 18 and a half. Oh, look at the kipe on that sucker, though. He is all jaw. Real clean, three in the corner. Yeah, yeah, it's 18, 18 and a half. 
tip. Uh, maybe just 18. 18. Nice little fish though. Like yeah, I got three right in the corner. Fish for the grill. We're just going to raise my fish, maybe. Bought a couple of these ones. A couple of these things. You smoke them whole, skin on? Yep. I just take the heads, gut them, wrap them, or uh, soak them overnight, like in a brine, brown sugar and salt. And what you have with small ones like this, with big salmon, I'll cut them in half. But well, those ones, you know, they cook so quick even when you smoke unless you got like a major cold, like Norwegian cold smoke, like 130, some shit like that. They cook pretty quick. Right. And leaving the Because even, even at 225, they're going to cook pretty quick. I mean, if you don't watch them, they'll be dried out. Oh, yeah. And that's the nice thing about doing it with the skin on. Yeah. The whole fish is that it doesn't dry out as bad, even if you get distracted by the football game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 